All right, guys, like I said, we're gonna grind this down to match that. We're gonna do this freehand. And then I got the stop finger sitting right here. All right, we're gonna come in and check my grind, just me freehanding this stuff, okay? So here we go. Getting hot. All right, guys, we're gonna bring this stop finger in. I think I've ground it a little bit too much. All right, but in order to do this properly, we gotta get this sitting about right there. Tighten it down. I got my eighth inch like I always like. Let's turn this off. Slow her down. Let's find one. Alright, we're way off. There you go. Let's see what happens. I think I've done pretty good. All right, guys. Like I said many times, when you deal with these manuals, always top grind before you side grind. So we've got a fixture on here, right wheel. We're just doing zero. So let's set this thing up for cut that one tooth down on the top. Just move our stop finger up. Now we gotta match this. White's gonna get in the way. Uh, that's pretty good. Right there where it's at. And that's on, uh, if I remember. 15. So now let's grind this down. y'all let's bring her back grind her out now I need to go it's sharp I need, I need to go ten thousand There's five. Let's go five more. All right, at this point, everything's lined up with side grinding. All right, guys, now. Alright guys, we've got us a little 
bolt in here for a steady rest. So let's huh, always start on this side for side grinding. stop finger all right got my stop finger up here uh, y'all seen this uh, I mean if you pay attention to the videos you've seen it 50 times uh, I have made sure this tooth is as straight in line with the travel of this work head as I can so before we start this I'm gonna scoot around to this and that's we're going to line up on it. All right. Set my stop. Let's go down. That should be it. Almost ten more. crazy right here. And we gotta keep doing it. Until thing was hitting like the other side was bare. Now, after about five minutes, we got this one ground in. I don't know, you know, there's a lot of hills on it, but we got it ground in. Now, we got to flip all this over to this side. So, Y'all really want to see this? I had two and a half, so I'm gonna go. No, two and a half. There you go. Now, let's take our stop finger. Before we can start though, we gotta line our teeth up. There you go. Crap. I hate this. We gotta take this. Well, we just gonna have to deal with it. I ain't taking it all the way back apart. Just tighten it down. Send it out there.
All right, so now we got our tooth lined up, we got our stop finger. We're just gonna come back up over the top of that wheel. Would you, you get everything zeroed up? There should be a problem. We're gonna come back in. And we're gonna touch off on it. I need to explain about side grinding on the 357. Um, if you need something more in depth than what I'm doing, we need to talk on a whole other level. Um, but anyway, I don't want to say it. We took it from beginning to end. We put a tip in it. We faced it. Got everything like it's supposed to be. We top ground it made sure it was the same as the rest of them. And then we side ground it, made sure it was the same as the rest of them. I, I, seriously, I, it's that simple. Um, unless you want to get down in tenths of a thousands. And there's no reason for that in, on most applications. Now, if you're cutting steel, you need to get into that um, and, and really make sure it's right. But okay, here... I think we're done with that. Now, let me talk to the car guys a minute. All right, guys. Here's what we got so far. We got a comp cam uh, stock. We got our water pump, fuel pump, timing chain, and lifters. Because the rest of that stuff I was going to scalp off the 85 Blazer. Hey, I got some stickers. Do you want them? I don't put this crap on my car. I ain't advertising for nobody unless they pay me. Uh, what? Oh, sorry. Yeah, good call, Lars. And the complete engine gasket set, main seals, all that. We ain't going to pull all that out. Okay. So I'm working to get this 84 done. Um, after this stint with the machine shop, I'm going to be honest with you. I haven't sent that crankshaft anywhere. Uh, main reason, there's no, sending that crank, no sense in sending that crankshaft somewhere. And I had to find somebody else to redo this block again. I mean, if I had to go pick it up. And I'm leaning towards doing the heads in the shop. Um, that's not a big issue unless it comes down to valve guys having me putting this stuff. Because um, I, I don't have the reamers, all that kind of stuff. And it'd be cheaper to send it somewhere, right, and get it done. But there you go. Uh, again, this Wednesday thing. Um, like I said, eight, about 8 p.m. Central Time on Wednesday. Um, I don't think that'll interfere with much church stuff. Um, everybody should be home by eight. Um, leave comments. I know the old man in the shop already commented. Heck yeah, do it, do it, do it, you know. Um, but anyway, 
that's what's going on. Honestly, we're still waiting on this block. Uh, I can explain the rest Wednesday. If you, if you come and join the live. All right. With that being said, we're done. Um, I hope you got something out of that sharpening stuff. Uh, I've went over like five times in multiple videos. Um, if you need something more than that, man, you know, we're going to have to talk on a whole enough again. Went through it. But anyway, I'm off here. We'll see you Wednesday. Um, everybody take care. Hope everybody's home and safe. Your family's home and safe. And everybody's having a good night. We'll see you on the next one.